Hey guys, what's going on out there? It's your boy Newbie, fifth episode, fifth appearance of yours truly. Today I got a fun one for you. Uh, last week I did a top five X-Men uh, affordable books to be on the lookout for. Today I'll be talking about five books I think you should be on the lookout for with Fantastic Four. Uh, before I get started, I want to thank everyone for subscribing lately, all the positive feedback I've gotten. Don't forget to hit the subscribe, like, notification bell, and guys at the end, like I always do, let me know what you think about the list. Let me know if I missed some books. Let me know if there's books you think I should be on the lookout for. Um, but without further ado, guys, let's get on to number five. All right, guys, so at number five, we have Fantastic Four, issue 204. Now, this is an important book because it does have a lot of first appearances. This is the first appearance of Nova Prime, Adora, Scroll X, and most importantly, it's the cameo appearance of the Nova Core. If you're into that Nova scene, you got the Nova One issue, um, this is a good book to pair it with and have it just in case that Nova thing really does take off. Um, white cover, a lot going on on the cover. Um, you guys know how I feel about white covers. Um, but I'm looking on eBay here, guys. 8.5 sold for 8 bucks, raw of course. Um, very good for $3.51. Um, the most expensive one I'm seeing here is uh, 8.5 raw selling for $17.87. And then there's a few guys, uh, another 9.4 for $16, uh, raw books, $2, $3, things like that. So this is a book definitely that's affordable um, and you can get your hands on. So definitely grab this book. Um, I'm not thinking that it will be uh, a book that gets you into the thousands, but definitely a book that you might be able to flip um, and make some good coin. So guys, at number five, we have Fantastic Four, issue 204. All right, guys, at number four, and this might be a tongue twister, but at number four, Fantastic Four, issue 205. I think some of you might have been uh, seeing where I was going with the number five pick, but number uh, 205 is the first full appearance of uh, Nova Corps. So if you got that Nova one and you got 204 and you get this one, I mean, that's a good trio to have. Um, this is also the first appearance of The Protector. Um, so another first appearance, a book that has two. Um, I believe those are very important. You never know. This book, you can't really miss. Purple cover, again, a lot going on. Um, but definitely affordable book. It is hard to find this one, I believe, in a very high gray raw. Like on eBay, I've been searching for a while. Can't get my hands on it. But there have been some few um, sold. I mean, there's one for $12 raw. Very fine for $20. Uh, near Mint Beauty, the guy put with a lot of emojis at $26 off of one bid. Then there's some that went for $10, $8 off three bids. So it is a book that not a lot of people are looking for and they're overlooking. I would definitely be on this uh, book if I were you guys, especially if I'm into that Nova scene. Um, definitely a book that could rise, but again, not a book that you're gonna see into the thousands. I hope I'm wrong, because if I do pick some up, I really want it to be in the thousands. All right, guys, at number three, we have issue 211. Now, this is the first appearance of Terax the Tamer. Um, definitely a character I believe will show up in the MCU at some point. Once we see Galactus, I personally don't think Galactus is just showing up by himself or with just Silver Surfer. I think it's going to be kind of like a Thanos thing where Thanos came with like a bunch of his uh, guys. Um, definitely a character I could see the Fantastic Four having... Uh, a fight or two with um, so definitely be on the lookout for this one this one has went up a bit in price um, that I've seen um, but definitely again it's it, it's a black cover so you know you have to be delicate with that especially in the higher grades um, so if you are buying it raw make sure you're looking at it scan the picture but definitely there's very good to find at $12 um, I don't know why people put so many emojis in their sellings but uh, one for 25 uh, very good for 33, 6.5 slash 7 for $33.70. I'm not seeing any graded ones yet. 7.0 for 37 bucks. So you're seeing the jump in price from the previous two, but definitely a book that I think could get into that $80 range. So definitely a book I would be on the lookout for. Again, if you're buying it raw, make sure you're looking at it very carefully because it is a black cover. 
a lot of those creases and things will show up. So definitely a book I'd grab. So guys, at number three, we have issue 211, the first appearance of Terax the Tamer. All right, guys, at number two, and a lot of you are going to be surprised at the prices here, but number two and number one are more expensive than the, the last three. So at number two, we have Fantastic Four, issue number 20. This is the first appearance of Molecule Man. Um, I think this is going to be important because Molecule Man does have an important say in the Secret Wars um, side of things, and I feel, me personally, uh, I think that's where the MCU is going next. So I do think that a lot of those characters responsible for the secret wars and all that will have a say will have their day on the, on the on the screens so this is definitely a book i'd be on the lookout for this is issue 20 which means it's early fantastic four early 1960 61 i believe it's 61 um definitely a book you're not going to find too many high uh grades of but definitely um obtainable books um here you got a very good for 150 raw you got a two 2.0 for 89, um, six and a half graded at 550, another raw estimated uh, 1.0, a 1.5 for 90. Um, definitely a book I would probably get graded already just because it's it's delicate. It's you're you're probably gonna find it low grade, but I mean here I'm seeing a 4.0 that sold for 188 dollars. Personally think that's a steal, um, especially because the 5.5 went for 323 so definitely a book that is obtainable um if you can only afford raw hey whatever um but definitely a book i'd be on the lookout for guys so at number two we have fantastic four issue 20 the first appearance of molecule all right guys down to number one and before i continue don't forget to hit the subscribe the thumbs up the like again don't forget to uh let me know if i missed a book if you got a book in mind that i should be on the lookout for in this run uh, I love the feedback guys. So without further ado at number one, we have Fantastic Four annual number six um, This is the first appearance of two characters first off Annihilus um, I personally don't think they're going the annihilation route I think they're doing the X-Men versus Avengers and then Secret Wars something like that um, He could show up you never know obviously um, it is a gamble um, I just don't see the annihilation thing happening for a while the other character that I'm bank that I'm banking on is uh, Franklin Richards. Um, I can totally see them probably in the second Fantastic Four movie, uh, just showing or letting the audience know that Sue's pregnant um, and that he does show up. Especially if they go the Secret Wars route, because he does have a say in that. Um, definitely a book I personally am on the lookout for. Um, be careful for the reprints. Um, I know a few people that have purchased the reprint. Um, so you don't want to be that person, um, especially if you're starting off. Just make sure you're doing your research. Um, but guys, from slab to raw, you're obviously going to see your up and down, not the same prices. Um, first off, let's go with slabs. Uh, five and a half sold for two thirty-seven. A four point zero for one ninety-four. Uh, a seven and a half went for six hundred. Uh, eight eight point zero went for a thousand. So um, there was a big jump there. Obviously, now when you get to the raw books, I mean a 6.0 raw, 200 bucks, uh, five. Um, you're looking at 170, uh, very nice, 240. So you're seeing that a reprint for eight dollars. Um, obviously, that I hope that person knows it's a reprint. Um, very good for 240. But again, you saw that slab at 4.0 at 194 so you just got to be on the lookout um, I know a few people who are selling this book I know a lot of people who are hoarding this book so um, definitely be on the lookout for this book so guys at number one we have fantastic Four annual number six it is a thicker book so be be cautious if you don't know what the book looks like or if you've never seen it um, it is one of those you know thicker books um, so yeah guys my number one fantastic Four annual number six I want to thank you guys for joining me. Until next time, guys. Thanks.